Let's check out the eggs. Oh! That looks amazing. Got a little bit of everything on there. Let's try it out. That's good. <laughs> check out that crust. Pretty crispy, y'all. For real. I'm not gonna lie, this is one of the best restaurants I've been to in a while. What's, What's good, guys? guys? Back with another video. In today's video, we're gonna be taking you guys through a full day of eating in Detroit, Michigan. We've been here for about two days now, so this is our second day exploring. We've got a good sense of the city, but today we have so much more to do. We're gonna be trying out three, four different food spots, and we're gonna be bringing you guys along the whole way. Right now, we're in downtown Detroit, and we're gonna go get some breakfast. We're gonna be eating the Dime Store. Oh. Hi, how's it going? Wonderful, uh, two of you? Yes. yes. See, right what are you gonna get? A cheese steak Betty. What does it look like? Let me show you. There you go, the Yelp queen looking at Yelp every time. <laughs> Looks good, right? It does. What are you gonna get? I'm gonna get the duck bop hash. T just asked the waiter if she recommends anything, and just so happens to be that we got the number one and number two most seller from the restaurant. I think our palates definitely are on par with this restaurant. Cheese steak Betty. I got the duck bop hash and the homemade buttermilk biscuit. All right, let's check out the eggs. Oh, that looks amazing. That looks so good. <laughs> Can't wait to take the first bite. Got a little bit of everything on there. Let's try it out. That's good. <laughs> That's a piece of happiness right there. <laughs> He's making me a good bite. I always got tired of food. <laughs> Walking out of brunch, I am definitely full and satisfied. That's for sure. I am that definitely was, good right now. I'm good. That was so good. <laughs> Very good. That was the dime store. Nice, perfect breakfast brunch spot. I got the duck bob hash and she got the cheesesteak benedict. And funny how things work. I liked hers better. She liked mine. <laughs> we did a little swap -a Everything works out. So it was great. Yours was tangy, spicy. Yeah. Mine was savory. And it complemented each other so well. What would you rate it? I was going to ask you. What were you going to rate it? Overall, I'm going to rate it an 8.6. Ooh. Yeah. Okay, okay. Overall, I'm rating an 8.7 out of 10. 8.7 out of yep. 10. Okay, cool. All right, we got a lot more food spots to go. Let's get it. Oh, yeah, look what we found. <laughs> okay, it's okay. Lit. Let's go link. Let's go scooter it up. Let's go link it up. Link it up. Let me pick you up, my dear. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh. Oh, do you need a ride? Oh, thank you. Beautiful. Mad nice, right? Yeah. Yo, this is so nice. <laughs> Just two people hanging out in Detroit on the river walk. That's Canada. Did you guys know that's Canada? Crazy. We just checked out the river walk, it was really nice. Now we're gonna try some Detroit style pizza. Detroit style pizza for the first time ever. Let's try it out. All right, Buddy's Pizza, let's try it out. All right, pizza finally came. We did about 25 minutes. We're gonna take the first bites and give you guys a full review. Come on. This is the first slice right here. Sauce on top. I know, right? Are you ready? It's different. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, pretty fire. Okay. Hmm. I'm a fan. That first bite was lit. Look at that crust right there. Look how crispy it is. Oh. Mm. There you go. There's that crunch. Uh huh. It's definitely not a New York style slice of pizza, but I'm rocking with it for real. Mm -hmm. Damn. I think I was holding the onions. Is it? No way, oh my. <laughs> it is an onion, man. <laughs> mm. 
Let me try a butter here. <laughs> this bite right here. Alright. Move your finger. Your sauce on top is a little bit sweeter than mine. Oh really? I feel like mine has a lot more seasoning on top. It gives it a little bit more of a Yeah, it's good. Everything's great. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah, we gotta switch. Try mine, try mine. Okay, okay, okay. You see what I'm saying? Like there's a lot more seasonings on top. So here you go. Here you go. Anyway, show them mine. And then this one's teased. It has a lot more sauce on top. That's what really makes a Detroit style Detroit style. Ready? Cheers. Cheers. Again, yo, perks of dating someone who's also a foodie, yo, you get to order things that complement each other and share it. One more curious. Mm. And to drink, we got a ginger soda, some burgers. Yo, if you guys know, you guys know. Yo, burgers, <laughs> fire. Cheers. I actually think I like yours more. Really? Yeah. Dang. It, it's more savory. Today is a weird day. I like yours better. No joke, I really Seriously? do. That last bite I just took, because yours is, again, it still has that crisp, a little bit of sauciness, but it also has a sweetness to it. I feel like mine is saucier, which that's why I don't like it as much. Mm. And your slice, I don't know, just, everything about it is good. It's kind of crazy that such a thick slice, they can get the bottom so crispy. Yeah, thanks. This is the bottom, and it's crispy. Mm -hmm. Alright, we're going to finish eating, and then maybe go find a basketball court. Maybe. Oh, yeah. Maybe. Okay, Teresa, what would you rate Detroit style pizza? Honestly, a 9 out of 10. 9 out of 10? We both agreed, 9 out of 10. I think it's, for me, it's definitely not a New York slice. No. But... It gives you a super unique experience. The bottom's crispy, the sauce is flavorful. It's more saucier. Yeah, what else can you ask for in pizza? So yeah, nine out of 10, pretty solid. Yeah. I definitely get it again. Is it better than New York Slice? No. no. Would, I, would I get it again? Absolutely. Only if it's crispy. To give you guys some reference, we came to Detroit on a unique weekend. Today is the Taylor Swift concert, so there are a bunch of Swifties, Swifties out there. So we're gonna go try to find them, <laughs> see where the lines are generating and just see where all the chaos is coming from. So let's go find some Swifties. Did you know that one of my favorite songs growing up was Love Song at 15? I actually didn't know that. Yeah. <laughs> you used to sing it all the time. Yeah. Oh, yo, look at the line. Oh, right. oh my God. That's crazy. Look at this. Yo, people have been waiting online since 4 a.m. They tripping. <laughs> <laughs> they real true Swifties. That's crazy. So many people out here. This is crazy. Yo, this is so lit. What, the what is it? Midway Park? Oh. Again, yo, this is everything we look for in the city. Good eats and some basketball. If I make this shot, you All right, come like on. Make a shot on Monroe Midway Street. If I make this shot, y'all gotta like the video. Oh. Cash. Okay. Yeah. 
robbed. Damn! Damn. 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 I got you, I got you. Give it. Go! Are you serious? Oh, he wants you out. He wants you out for real. He wants you down. What you got? I got five. Huh? Wait, 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 wait. So you're going to be the first one out? Yeah, she gets seven. If she, yeah, she gets seven, she got a rebound for everybody, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> if you miss, you only have six. We ain't tripping. Woo! Thank you for the rebound. Yo, Josh, nice meeting you, bro. Nice meeting you too, man. Y'all have a good. Yeah, take care. Yep. Uh, what type of tea is it? So, it's a black tea, and it has fresh squeezed citrus fruit, and it's sweetened with honey. Oh. Um, here, I'll let you try it out. Cool. Awesome. Thank you. So, Cheers. 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 Yes. Bottoms up. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's yeah. Good. Some of this. <laughs> Your samples got us. Okay. Yeah. So, um, would you like the, the large bottle for ten dollars or two slushies? Let's do two slushies. Two slushies. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're gonna drink it now. <laughs> Thank you. Is this all, is is this all homemade? This is homemade. Oh yeah. This is my recipe. Yes. Oh shoot. It's so good. Yes, Where do you get the honey from? So different local markets. So, okay. Yeah. That's I've lit. been making for over twenty years. So. Wow. Yeah. Stacy's tea. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. God damn. Yo, you could taste the raw honey in this for real. Mm -hmm. Wow. So refreshing on a hot day. Y'all gotta check out her tea at Cadillac Square. All right, well, we just took a quick nap. We're gonna have an early dinner because we gotta save some time for dessert. But uh, we're gonna go going to this place called Olin's for dinner. We'll show you guys that. Olin's Kitchen, let's talk about it. Great recommendation that we got from our friend. So shout out to you, Liz, that's a great recommendation. First of all, we weren't really starving, so we wanted to do a lot of small plates. So we got a lot of the starters and then we made that our entree, which I feel like we kind of do a lot. That was so, good, I think that was a good choice. Yeah, we got like four things and it was a perfect meal. What did we get? We got potatoes and artichoke, braised lamb with pita, yellowfin tuna tartar mm -hmm. with crispy rice. Oh yeah, the bottom was super crispy yes. on that too. And they had this homemade bread, but the best thing with that was the honey butter that came with it. That was so good. The main thing that we really enjoyed, it's actually in one of the best potato dishes I've ever had. The potatoes and artichoke. The potatoes were just so crispy. It, it had the perfect crunch on top, and I mean perfect. I'm not gonna lie, yeah. I was gonna rate it a 9.3. I'm giving a 9.2, a, a confident 9.2. When you're in Detroit, you gotta hit up Olin's. Mm -hmm. Highly recommend. And make sure you get the potatoes and the artichoke, I know. <laughs> Who thinks like the potatoes are the best thing ever, but yo, that it's place. good like that. Oh. It's a whole Should town. we play some blackjack? Maybe put a budget of $500. Yo! Maybe nah. win some extra cheddar, <laughs> as the guy in the Uber said. <laughs> <laughs> he, was like, he was like, oh, if you got some extra cheddar laying around. <laughs> yes, sir. Yo, they watched it on TikTok. Yo, much love, though, for real, bro. Real shit. Appreciate that, yo. Real shit. What's, yo, is that your name? Is that what's your name? Boy, my name's Shark Sound on the microphone. You heard me. Security of the world. You feel me? Best on God. On game. Like, come on. <laughs> All right, yo. Appreciate that, guys. Yo. You feeling some ice cream, though? Post dinner, death. Yo, it's so early still. I know. I mean, it's only, it's 7.30 still, and it looks like there's no sign of the sun going down. Nope. That's what's good about June in Michigan. Yo, ice cream now or in a little bit? Let's walk there so that we get it in a little okay. bit. Okay, or scooter if you want to keep your mind open. Thank you. There we go. Yo. Perfect dessert. Some awesome local soft serve. Yes. Cheers. Wow, this chocolate dip is insane. So glad we got this. No. This just might be hit for a 10 out of 10 right here. <laughs> <laughs> the only 10 out of 10 of the day. All right, let me try yours now. Swap these. Switch a Rooney. Uh-oh, how do I do this? I'm rocking with this one though. Something that's really cool about Detroit that I didn't know, they have like these little alleyways that have like restaurants and bars and ice cream shops in between. 
Honestly, super cool. Yeah. All the good food's there. Yeah. That's where we got this. <laughs> Cheers, guys. A perfect way to end exploring a city. With a cone. Yep. It is 8.21 right now, and still the sun shows no signs of going down. Supposedly until 10 o'clock is when the sun goes down, but honestly, we did so much today, I don't even know if I'm going to make it to 10 o'clock. <laughs> yeah, we did a lot today. We, we went did. to a lot of spots. And we started early. Yeah. We also started at the river walk, and uh, look where we are. Yeah. We're at the river walk. That's Canada. <laughs> and Canada. <laughs> so, yeah, I don't know. We're just going to hang out here and just be in the moment. Like I was saying, yo, what time is it now? It is 9.03. 9.03, and still, the sun is still taking its time setting. Yo, like, just look at this view, and look at Canada. It's the last time I'll say it, guys, I promise. The yeah. last time. It's crazy, yo, look at this. This view is insane. I know, we've hung out here so many times now. It's beautiful. Yeah. But yeah, guys, we are coming to the end of the video. Real quick, quick recap. This was so much fun. It was both our first times in Michigan, mm -hmm. first time in Detroit. Anytime you visit a new city, we, just, always, we always have a good time because yeah. it's just new things, new environment, new people, and scooter time. You know I love my scooters, guys. Link, yep. I love you guys. Come on, if you're seeing this, wouldn't mind a little, little sponsorship. Like. <laughs> and another unique thing to Detroit is that a lot of the people really rep Detroit. Like a lot of the locals that we talk to, people we chat around basketball, they love their city. Like they really love their Bro. city. And there's so much history behind it. And honestly, that's something I've been appreciating more the history behind cities. All right, guys, with that being said, we're coming to the end of the video. We love these scooters. So, this is the end of the video. Make sure to like, like comment, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Peace.